Hello everybody, it's Vertical Sandwich. Welcome back to Let's Play Unravel. So, uh, this, this file, actually, um, I managed to record this file, and, uh, the video file ended up corrupted. It was really weird. I could watch it, but then it started getting all skippy and strange. So, uh, we actually have two levels left. And, uh, so there will be a trophy that I got that won't pop, um, but I will talk about it. And, uh, so let's go in here. Okay, so what we have to do in this level is drag this lamp, because every once in a while the wind will blow, and it will blow you off the screen, and it will kill you. There are no collectibles in this level. We just have to get the lamp to the end of the level. So there is, there is something that I do find everything kind of about this last challenge. Um, I find it absolutely amazing that like just kind of what they did with theme and pace to make this as hard as it is. Like, it just seems very desperate. It seems very sad. All right, we have to get up on the lantern, I think. So we're going to wait until it blows blows us around again. There's a lot of that. You want to be very patient in this level. Because as long as you're tied to the lantern, you're okay. Okay, now once we get to this part, the wind will actually push the lantern back down the hill. And so what we want to do is grab it, and then we want to tie off here, tie off to the lantern. And now it can't go anywhere. And we untie here, and we start dragging it, and we drag it up to the next one. I hope that does it. I think that does it. It does it. Okay, good. Oh, I'm still tied. Don't do this! Don't do this to me! <sighs> that was horrible. That was absolutely horrible. I don't know why it thinks I ever had a headset connected. What's going on with that? No, now... I've got to keep this going for another cycle, because that doesn't make any sense. I've never hooked a headset up.
Don't fall down. Why do you, why does he why does it fall down the hill like that? It's really horrible. Guess I tie into this thing first. Didn't mean to do that. This is super frustrating. Maybe I just need to do it that way. Tie on and then tie to this. And then untie from this and pull. Does that work? That does seem to work. Oh, I untied it. <sighs> right, because I had all those loops and stuff. Great. Fantastic. You just... I had some trouble with this in my practice file, but nothing... Or, er, in my first go through this, but nothing like this. Where is the rest of my yarn? Why can't... I mean, it's untied now. We're starting over. That kind of works. What is it tied to? Okay, so that doesn't work. Oh, because I tied it. Right, right. It doesn't need to be tied. I'm tying the yarn so that the yarn can't come out anymore. Got it. So what I gotta do is just do this and... Can I just tie to this? Does that work? If I just, you know, tie to that like a mountaineer? Uh, not even a little. Not even a tiny bit. Now I untied it. Great. Great. Fantastic. So, the thing that they're kind of going for here... Oh, I don't... I, right, I shouldn't tie that. The thing they're really going for here is kind of, you know, frustration and hopelessness and, and, and things like that. And they nail it. I mean, that's the way this feels. Yeah, we get them both going. Tie this. Tie that. It's barely enough time for that. Stop sliding downhill. Oh, that hurts so bad. It hurts so bad to have that happen like that.
And now I'm just gonna untie when I get up there again. <sighs> I don't remember how I got this done. I suppose what happens if I do this now? And that's not gonna help me. That's not gonna help me at all. I don't think I need to untie the one on the ground. This is really hurt by having a bunch of knots that need to be undone now. No. Oh, you know what I can do is I can do this. That will actually reset all my knots and stuff. It doesn't count as a death. <sighs> okay. No time. Why did he go back toward the other knot? It's like I pressed the tie a knot button and he went... Okay, so we're just gonna wait. We're gonna wait. We're gonna have to get optimal time here, right? I'm gonna have to do this. Don't untie it! Okay, so we pull up here, tie, tie, hold on. Now we untie and pull. Tie, tie, barely make it. And that didn't work. Now that one did. Okay. Will this stay up here now? Is the question. Just barely. Okay. Hang on to this, make sure I get a good... So that was the hard part of the level. We still haven't died, though, so.
Okay, so at this point, uh, we abandoned the... the lamp. Now it's all about riding the ice. I'm not dying, but, uh, yeah. Huh. You actually can jump from piece of ice to piece of ice. That's what I did in my other file. It was just like, jump to here. And then you can jump back. Which I think is what they want, but... <sighs> I got through this without dying the first try, and was just like, yes, I'd never have to do this again. And now here I am. Come on. Okay. Oh, we made it. Good. Now I'll do it again. But this one's a lot easier to ride. Are you... Oh, I didn't... I didn't grab... There's a hook above there. Oh, come on. Don't be like me. Don't make the same mistakes I made. And we get this one kind of for free. And then we... Why? W why? Game. Oh, wow. Okay, we made it. Finally, we made it. Now these should come out from underneath. And we should be able to ride them as well. I mean, again, it's desperation. It's, uh... It's frustration. But we made it. It just looks so sad. Everything's so sad. It's so helpless. Cold. Yarny's so tough. Like, Yarny's just got a job to do. Now we're hoping this is going to show the cutscenes. Because, uh, usually the game goes right into the next level when you play this for the first time. And there we go. So, you know, the, the strand of yarn came to an end. So now, when you play this level for the first time, you don't have a choice. You just go straight into the last level. And the last level is a more standard level, so let's do that. Oh, this actually is the way it plays. Okay, so this also just takes you straight into the last level. Alright, so the dynamic in this level is there's no way to die, there's no puzzles what there are, are these these firefly things and you lasso them and they just carry you and the trophy we got that won't show is you have to lasso 25 of them without touching the ground
Just watch, cause they want it. You, they want to get it. If you get a swing rhythm going, you can really go higher than you want. But you can see how such a trophy is achieved, right? So what you want to watch for in this level is anywhere that these things go up, like so. Because that means there's a secret up here. Now, we have gotten all the secrets out of this level already. But this one happens to be at the top of this tree. Or this one was at the top of the tree. Probably gonna end up getting 25 trying to do this. One of the things that can be kind of hard about this is, like I said, watch out about uh, like a, getting a swing rhythm going, where you're really flying around the screen. See, this can be really brutal. I mean, not in a horrible way, in a tedious way. Because there really aren't a lot of consequences for doing it wrong. Other than that, the level is pretty straightforward. So let's see if we can find where the next secret was. I mean, this is like a big question mark right here, right? Does it continue going up? But I believe the answer to that is no. I think it's fairly obvious where the secrets are in this level as far as where you can go up. So the next one is actually up here by these flowers. Right, the game is... The game does not want you to jump up things. That's not its gig anymore. It wants you to fly. Okay, so this is where our next one is. This first part was very hard, if I remember. Because these have, like, an alternate rhythm, so, you know, if you... Okay, so this is where our second secret lives. Is up in those branches. And this is where our third secret is. It is on this boat, and you can rappel down to it, you can walk to it. The level, This level is not about being hardcore enough to really make you suffer. So, uh, yeah, we've suffered. We suffered through the worst winter, and kind of the awfulness of that. And we tore ourselves apart trying to accomplish our goal, and we have been resurrected. 
So, when we come back, uh, the end of Unravel. <laughs>